Hey guys, welcome back to Day to Day Chest. This is Sabina and I would like to start off this video by saying that I apologize for having a day to day um, YouTube channel and blog and not being able to post every single day. It's uh, in the past two weeks or so, it's been a little bit tough for me adjusting to my new job and um, when you don't really have many things to do and you can just do what you please, of course, you can always manage your time well. But uh, when you start getting more things to do, you think you can be a wonder uh, woman or a wonder man and just um, get them done no matter what. Still, you do them. Um, I still need to, to be sure that my health is okay and I still get um, enough sleep before being able to go to job and do what I have to do there. So, no excuses, but um, I'm going to start creating a specific um, schedule so that you guys know when I'm going to post and when I'm going to post for that specific week and unless some important event is coming up or I see some specific game that's really important for me to show um, I would just go with the plan so like that you guys know what to expect for every single week and you know whether you're going to check it out or not hopefully you will and uh, please do not forget to share it with your friends um, if you can, if you think it's, it's nice. And um, of course, you're making me a favor, you're making them a favor, most importantly. So um, that's basically what I wanted to say. Having said that, now let's get back to chess a little bit. And hopefully you will enjoy my new... Um, composition test let's say so because last time when I did this um, I was told that I put the answers too fast so for today I will be giving you two positions so this one and one more and you have to find the solutions please be sure to solve it yourself and not put engines or you know move the pieces don't do that try to solve it yourself without moving the pieces they're not that difficult and in fact there are two pro uh, problems with mates the first one is a mating three and the second one a mating five moves so I would say it's quite easy to calculate it's not that difficult I just believe they are really beautiful from the way they were composed so here is a shout out let's say to um, my subscribers who are watching this video, be sure to comment in the description below and share it with at least a friend. So, um, you know, let me know with whom you shared it. Uh, hopefully they are not subscribed. They have not subscribed uh, to my YouTube uh, channel just yet. And um, yeah, and I'll see uh, what prices I come up with. But, you know, I want everybody to get in shape and as focused as possible and you know just comment and um, that's it you know just enjoy two beautiful um, mates okay so this is the first position and it is why to move it was created by Edward Lasker probably you know early 1900s or so I'm not familiar with this um, I came across it recently and I really like this position so why to move and mate in three be sure to solve this position. The next position that I had prepared for you is the following position. And this position was created by Sam Lloyd in 1861. It's, um, let's say, quite a famous position. But um, still, you have to solve it. <laughs> don't cheat, don't check the answers online, and most definitely do not use engines to solve this position. White to move here and mate in five. Try to see um, the theme that could be happening in this position. Try to see how, uh, what mate ideas white could have and, you know, how to make them happen. And with that said, um, I let you go. Uh, for tonight, this will be it. And um, like I said, for next week, I will be preparing a specific uh, plan for the week so that you guys are familiar with what's going to happen and hopefully um, are going to check out my, my videos. Okay, have a good night and end of the week. Bye!